everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you a quick um, Valentine's Day look featuring some Nuke Sticks products that I've recently discovered. Um, keep on watching if you want to see how I got this look. Okay, so as always I'm going to begin with some skincare. So for skincare lately, I'm uh, using some Solwasu. It's uh, this K-Beauty, of course, that means Korean. So this is the serum. So I'm pretty sure this serum has lots of um, botanical ingredients because it smells like very floral. Actually smells like gin, um, fun fact. So on top of that, I'm using the Essential Firming Cream. It's pretty thick, but it does dissipate. So you don't need too much of this. Don't make sure you take it down the neck. So since this is a Valentine's Day look, I think it should be really glowy. Um, I, I want to up my all-over bronziness with some more of these Isle of Paradise drops. I this is such a cool product. I love these so much. Uh, I did get a little bit of dry skin, so I stopped using it for a few days. But I did some proper exfoliation and voila, back to normal. I would say that's four drops. One mistake I made last time is I didn't bring this down my neck and I kept having to bronze my neck to match my face. So make sure you bring this down your neck and even a little bit on your chest if you so desire. So there's my skin. So I just wet my beauty blender. I'm actually gonna be trying out a sample of their pore minimizer um, primer. I wanna start using a primer more. So let's put this around areas I get shine. For foundation, I'm going to use this one from Dior. Next, I finally got this. It's the Tatcha um, Eye Illuminator. I'm in the middle shade. It looks like this. And then I just kind of dot it. So it's got little pearlescent uh, flecks in it so that it really reflects the light in and around the eye socket. And it's just so beautiful. I love this. This was the sample I used in the other video. So yeah, I'm just putting that, I've been putting that on with my fingers. I'm, I haven't really found another way to do, want to do that yet. Something else that's new that I've been doing is liquid contouring with some darker foundation samples. Um, so I'm using this dark one here. It's from Jouer and the colors Suede. So it's very dark. Okay, so with a clean brush, just kind of buff out the color into a contouring shape. Beauty Blender just works better at this point because it's wet and I kind of took a long time so it's, <laughs> it's a little <laughs> dried. But there we have some neck contour. Next, OK, 
Okay, so like the whole point of this video is so that I can show you different ways to use the Nude Sticks Magnetic Plush Paint. Um, so the color I got, I put both of my Nude Sticks things in here because I love this tin. Um, it's so cute, huh? Magnetic, magnetic lip plush paint. And um, this can be used on the eyes or the lips. This has such a nice creamy feel to it. I used kind of a dense-ish brush. So there we have that kind of look. And it's just like very natural, um, kind of flushed, and very pretty, and so nice and creamy. I love the finish. Should we put it on the eyes as well? Why not? matte color in just the corners and underneath it is illegible <laughs> but it is a something that I used to use for my eyebrows so I'm using this powder right now it's a loose powder from well people it's a bio brightening invisible powder so it's white. Just with a little. Because nobody wants to be shining the wrong spots on Valentine's Day, we're gonna powder where we did more of the the primer. So in the center, down the nose, around the nose, and under the eyes. And this is a nice brightening powder, so it's not gonna create any darkness or anything. I also have this liquid liner. It's from the Roller Girl Lash collection from Benefit. And I'm just going to do a line on the top of my lid. Let's hope. <laughs> Nobody really wants to overdo it on a Valentine's Day. This is nice. Let's put on more. So I also have this. It's from Nude Sticks. It's a lip, lip and cheek color, gel color. Here we go. So let's put a bit of pink on here too. I always found this color was too light for me, but maybe mixed in with the red, it won't be too bad. So I actually really like layering blushes because it gives a couple dimensions. Um, the brush, the blush, that, <laughs> the blush that I normally use is actually two colors, so it does can do a little bit of that iridescence anyway. But like this is so much nicer. Do you see that? Like gradual fade I did as opposed to before where it was just like orangey so yeah so maybe now this is the finished look I hope you uh, learned something and I hope you guys give these pa magnetic paints a try everything I've tried from nude stick so far I seem to like and it's like a really beachy kind of um, makeup collection so, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. I hope everybody has a beautiful Valentine's Day with their loved ones or with their uh, Netflix account, if that's what you would rather do. Uh, thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.